Hey citizens, thanks for stopping by. In today's video, let's take a close and personal of this 2020 all-new Toyota Corolla Altis. This particular trim that is going to be featured in today's video is the 1.6G. It is mated to a CVT transmission. For this video, I'll take this 2020 Toyota Corolla Altis G for a full walk-around review and showing you the most interesting features from the interior as well as the exterior. So, what are you waiting for? Let's sit back, relax, and enjoy of this review. As of its launch way back September 2019, the 2020 Corolla Altis has two different engine choices, which is the 2ZR-FXC 1.8-liter hybrid gasoline engine or a 1ZR-FE 1.6-liter petrol engine. This 1,598 cubic centimeter engine is featured with a dual over cam, 16 valve, and naturally aspirated inline four cylinder petrol engine with electronic fuel injection and dual VVTi technology. It produces 121 horsepower at 6,000 rpm and 153 newton meters of torque at 5,200 rpm. Fuel tank size is 50 liters with a compliance of Euro 4. This engine can be mated either to a 6-speed manual gearbox or a continuously variable transmission better known as CVT. The drivetrain of the Corolla Altis is a front-wheel drive vehicle. The Corolla Altis, better known globally as the Corolla, is a compact sedan from Toyota produced since 1966. For the past 53 years, the Corolla has become one of the best-selling car in the market. For the 12th generation, the Corolla has been redesigned bringing the car an intensive complete different level. The Corolla has divided into two different versions such as Sporty and Prestige. The Sporty version was firstly launched at the Carmel by the Sea, California way back November 2018 that was sold in North America, Japan, China that was sold as Levin, and other countries. The Prestige, however, was firstly launched at the 2018 Guangzhou International Motor Show that was being sold for the international markets like Europe, China, Southeast Asian countries, and others. As being noticed, the Prestige version Corolla, including its front fascia, was relatively similar to the XV70 Camry. In my own perspective, the Corolla was definitely the sexiest and elegant car that I ever see. Moreover, the Corolla was riding on a TNGA platform that was used in any Toyota latest vehicle such as the all-new RAV4, Camry, CHR, and others. All in all, the Corolla is an attractive compact sedan in the market. It looks decent, yet it is a killer car that you will make your world to be distracted on its remarkable design that Toyota did. Hence, Mr. Akio Toyoda, the president and CEO of Toyota, was right. He said that there is no such thing as boring cars. By all means, this car has stepped up to its next expedition of sportiness and the like. The Corolla Altis nameplate was used mostly in Southeast Asian markets. The 2020 Toyota Corolla Altis in the Philippines was launched way back September 2019. Five trims have offered 1.6E manual, 1.6G manual and CVT, 1.6V CVT, and the topping range 1.8V hybrid CVT. Exterior features for the 2020 Corolla Altis GCVT includes manual leveling halogen projector headlights, LED daytime running lights, gloss black upper front grille with chrome highlights, gloss black lower front grille, front intermittent wipers, indicators on the body colored side mirrors, body colored door handles, full LED rear combination lights, LED high mount stop light, and rear glass printed antenna. In terms of safety, the 2020 Corolla Altis GCVT gets six airbags anti-lock braking system with electronic brake force distribution, vehicle stability control, hill start assist, Isofix child seats and tether anchors for the rear seats, child-proof door locks for the rear doors, speed-sensing door locks, 
and alarm system with immobilizer equipped with Toyota Vehicle Security System. The 2020 Corolla Altis G gets a set of 16-inch multi-spoke aluminum alloy rims covered in 20555R16 tires. Brakes consist of ventilated discs in front and solid discs out back. McPherson struts and double wishbone setup are the suspension components that can be functional for both front and rear. Both suspensions have stabilizer bars. Speaker down there, auto holder, storage, mirror controls, window lock, center locking, window controls, all four windows in this car are fully powered while the driver's side window gets a fully automatic function in both directions. Headlight adjuster, this lever pops up your bonnet, this lever pops up your trunk lid, and this lever right here pops up your fuel door. The driver's seat of this Toyota Corolla Altis G gets a fully manual adjustments. Got your seat back, height adjuster, and sliding position controls. You have the same set of adjustments as found on the driver's side. However, it loses out on the height adjustment. The 2020 Toyota Corolla Altis gets a rack and pinion power steering system with electric assistance. Standard on this G trim is a three spoke leather wrapped steering wheel with sport grips at 10 and 2, contrast stitching going around the inner rim, satin chrome at the bottom spoke, and a multi function controls can be found at the top two steering wheel spokes. A CVT or continuously variable transmission is offered on a 1ZR FE 1.6 liter petrol engine. CVT is a version of a conventional automatic gearbox but it has an unlimited number of gear ratios which enables to maximize fuel economy as well as a smoother driving feel. It does come with manual shifting via the plus and minus on the gear lever. Fabric padded center armrest and underneath. It is a pretty decent amount of size storage area with a 12 volt power outlet that has a maximum of 120 watts of power. Two cup holders, hand operated parking brake. This button right here turns off or on your vehicle stability assist. Storage. Got your single zone automatic climb control system with all of your controls located right here. It is quite simple to use. On the left is your temperature knob together with your automatic button. Off, front and rear defrost, different modes, eco heat cool, recirculation, flow of your air, air conditioning and your fan speed controls on the right side. Hazard switch flanked with two air vents. The 2020 Corolla Altis 1.6 GCVT gets a T-Link infotainment audio head unit that features a 7-inch colored touchscreen display, various media connectivity options including your Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, and six speakers for the sound system. Now, here's the screen itself. And on the right side of your screen, here's your USB and auxiliary ports, as well as your um, CD player, which is right on top. Tweeters on both sides. This button right here corresponds you to control the multi-information display right within the instrument gauge. Wiper controls to the right. 
and your lighting indicator controls to the left. On the steering wheel, the left spoke houses your audio controls with your up, down, left, right, and your OK button, your go back telephone button for your Bluetooth telephone menu, your volume controls, as well as your voice recognition system. While on the right side is your mode button, it doubles up as your mute button once you press and hold the mode button. And on the right side of your mode button is your seek track button. The steering wheel of this Corolla Altis gets a manual tilt and telescopic adjusting using the sliver right here. Group handles on the ceiling for the driver's side. The driver's side does get a sun visor with a vanity mirror. Interior lights right above. And a manual dimming rear view mirror. Sun visor with a vanity mirror. For the front passenger side. You also have a grip handle on the ceiling. What a perfect size glove box. With your owner's manual. Speaker down there, storage, window control, the rear seats can be do fold down in a 60-40 manner, use this button right here, push this button in order to fold down the rear seat back. This one is 40, while this one is 60. You do have adjustable headrests, front and rear. I do set the driver's seat in a position that I feel comfortable in. I'm about 5 foot 9 which is about 1.7 meters tall. And I do have the room to stretch out my feet underneath at the driver's seat. As for leg room. I 
I have this much while I have this much in terms of headroom now in terms of space it is not actually quite not bad right here it is really really spacious inside the back seat of the Corolla Altis and this fabric seats makes a comfortable ride to it and these seats right here it's a uh, nicely plush and soft and overall, it's not uh, pretty bad on this kind of uh, class, this C-segment car. You do have storage pockets in the front seat backs. Two air vents. Group handles with a hook for both sides for the rear. Cabin light. And you also have a center armrest with two cup holders. Boot space of the Corolla Altis is pretty much a decent size. For extra room for your luggage, fold down the rear seats to accommodate more space. Underneath at the boot floor are the vehicle's spare tire, toolkit, and jack. Well guys, I hope you enjoy of this full walk around review of the 2020 Toyota Corolla Altis 1.6 G that is mated to a CVT or continuously variable transmission. If you like this video, make sure to hit thumbs up, share it with your friends and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now if you're subscribed to my channel, please hit the notification bell button to get notified for my latest updates. And don't forget, follow all of my social media platforms. As always, I'll see you next time for more latest videos on YouTube.